I'm going on vacation last weekend, so what better way to relax than to do a little face mask? I'm feeling a little bit... My skin's not as happy as it should be. That usually happens whenever we travel because I get busy when we're traveling, I get lazy when we get back, and my skin takes the blunt of the punishment. So I am actually going to go in and use the rest of my Lush. This is the Rosy Cheeks Mask. It says cleanse from cheek to cheek. A rosy mask with plenty of calamine powder and rose clay to soothe skin. When I went to Lush and was looking at the different fresh masks, this is a fresh mask, so refrigerate it. When I was looking at all the different fresh masks they offer there at Lush, I was looking at the different ones and I was having a hard time picking and I will say I've had such great experiences with the Lush staff. They're always very helpful, which I really appreciate. And she just asked me, what are you looking for? What are you using right now? And I, right now I am using my Unique Skin Care and then maybe every other day I'm using the Lush Charcoal uh, Face Cleanser, which is like legit charcoal and sugar and it's a scrub. And so it's not hard on your skin, but it's not delicate either. She said, okay, so since you're going a little bit harsh currently, you know, you've got that exfoliation going on, she recommended something a little bit more mellow. And I said, I kind of just want something to liven up my skin and make it just look a little happier, a little healthier. And she recommended this Rosy Cheeks Mask. It smells so good. It does need to be refrigerated. Make sure you refrigerate this. I love that this comes out of the refrigerator. It's cold and it feels like an extra spa-like experience. I'm just about out. I think this will be using up the last of it. I think it smells so good. It's got a definite rose scent. It's nice and pink, which I believe is the calamine powder that's in there, right? Cal yep, calamine powder. So all I do is with a clean hand is I scoop it out ooh, and I apply it. Maybe this will be the extra boost to my day outside of the coffee I've been drinking. <laughs> I am going to apply a fairly thick coat. But I'm getting low, so I might not have enough to get every little speck of my face. <laughs> I put this on the other day. I didn't tell my hubby that I was putting it on and I came out and he goes, oh, what's on your face? I was like, a face mask. Duh. Okay. So I'm scraping the bottom of the barrel here and finishing it out. Don't throw these away. I made that mistake when I first got into Lush products. I threw, I actually go, let me just add this randomly. I put a little bit on my eyelids. Now, I wouldn't recommend getting this too close to your eyes or getting it in your eyes, but I have dark eyelids. They get a little bit red, and I like to put a little bit on there. And then very carefully, I'm going to smooth it up just a little closer to my eye area, but still not getting close enough that it could get in there or get into that really delicate area around my eyes. But don't throw these away. Oh my gosh, I just saw myself in the viewfinder. Anyways, don't throw these little cartons away. I made that mistake. When you collect five of these, you can bring it back in for a free face mask. I believe it says that on here somewhere, but I wasn't smart enough to pay attention to that. Bring back five clean Lush Pops with this logo and get a free brush face mask. How cool is that? So I have a little um, corner shelf in my shower. I use my... Dark Angels scrub in the shower because it is messy, very messy. And so I'm actually stacking them there. I have two currently. This one will now be on top. And in probably a few short months, I'll have two more cartons of these and I'll get a free face mask. So it's definitely worth hanging on to. This is a 10 minute mask, I believe. Five to 10 minutes. Wash off with warm water. So I'm going to let this sit for 5 or 10 minutes, and then I'm going to take a shower to rinse it off, and I'll be back to let you know how my skin feels. Alright everyone, I'm back and all showered and cleansed and rosified. <laughs> um, I really love this Rosy Cheeks Fresh Face Mask. Like, I really, really enjoy it. I'm going to zoom in, and as you can see my pores. I have really large pores. I blame my dad for those jeans and I can tell you I see such a huge difference. I'm not exactly sure if that's because of the calamine or the rose extract or the fact that it is a tightening mask. One thing you'll notice when you put this mask on is it goes on 
really thick and creamy and as it dries it dries down into kind of that tight feeling mask not as tight as a pure clay mask that is like so tight it hurts this one just tightens up as it sets I'm really not sure what part of the mask process if it's the ingredients or just the mask itself that makes my pores look so much smaller but I can see such a huge difference after I wear this mask. Like I really like, I can look in the mirror and I'm like, wow, my pores look so much smaller. And that's before I tone, moisturize anything and I see a difference. So I'm really impressed with it. It just makes my skin feel really nice. It's just an enjoyable mask to use. Some masks can be a pain in the butt to put on or irritating to the skin. This one is just really nice and gentle. On Lush's website, it claims that this mask is a simple blend of kaolin, calamine, and Turkish rose oil to calm skin and restore balance. Whether you're feeling hot and bothered or just fancy showering your complexion with roses, cleansing calamine and ka kaolin, I'm not sure how to say that, will gently remove dirt. Rose oil nourishes and tones your face. So maybe it is the rose oil that is helping my pores shrink up since it has a toning effect. It says relax for 10 to 15 minutes. On here it says 5 to 10. I honestly usually go a bit past the 10 minute mark. Uncover calm matte skin. It sounds like it's really beneficial for all skin types. And this mask is, this is in not American dollars. Let's find one I can read. <laughs> I don't know pounds to US dollar ratio at all. So 2.1 ounces, is that the size I have? So I have the 2.1 size, 2.1 ounce size container. This was $12.95 according to online. It's not bad. This has lasted me quite a while and I've used it several times. You could put a minimal amount, you could put more on depending on what kind of mask experience you're trying to have. I highly recommend this product. If you've tried this fresh face mask or any other lush fresh, fresh faced mask, masks, if you have tried any other Lush Fresh, this is a tongue twister. How many times can you say it and how fast? <laughs> if you have tried any of, oh my gosh, okay. If you have tried this Lush Fresh Face Mask, oh my goodness, I cannot get that out, or any of their other Fresh Face Masks, <laughs> please let me know which ones you've enjoyed I would love to hear from you guys because it'll help me pick out the next one I give a try I really do recommend this one I think it could be great for all skin types if you have any skin irritation eczema rosacea or oily skin acne scarring acne I mean really this kind of encompasses all skin types. I literally thought my washing machine was gonna take off sorry <laughs> so please let me know what masks you enjoy using from Lush I would love to hear from you guys if you have any questions about this video or any of my other beauty beliefs please let me know I'm happy to share my thoughts with you thank you for stopping in I truly appreciate that you would take the time to stop in and check out my channel it means so much to me and as always you guys try to stay positive because at the end of the day that is truly all we can try to do thank you so much for watching have a wonderful day